The Asia Vision 2021 Awards was virtually staged for the second consecutive year due to COVID-19. The awards given recognizes the efforts of the Asia Pacific Broadcast Union members in news reporting and coverage. ABU News Director Wendy Everett says despite the current global situation, the awards attracted many entries in the eight categories in which MTV was also a nominee. Thank you to our esteemed reporters, editors, camera operators and all who battled the pandemic in the service of their audience. Despite the conditions, this year's awards attracted many more entries and especially better quality journalism overall. Let me end by congratulating all members for another excellent year of the Asia Vision News Exchange and especially the nominees and winners of the Asia Vision Annual Awards 2021. MTV was among three other broadcasters shortlisted for the outstanding reporting from the PASFI category. This category was introduced last year to encourage the active participation from ABU's Pacific members. MTV's collaborative effort in broadcasting the special courage of the late Grand Chief Sir Michael Somare won the award. And the worthy winner of Outstanding Reporting from the Pacific, EMTV Papua New Guinea. But it was also a historical moment for broadcasting and television in Papua New Guinea. Um, and, uh, you know, I just want to say thank you to everyone that had a hand in our broadcast, including the other two broadcasters and all the staff of MTV for their hard work and their dedication uh, during the, 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 the special coverage during a couple of days. Uh, but thank, thank you, Asia Vision, for recognizing our efforts. The extensive courage of the occasion of the country's founding father and former Prime Minister awarded as the outstanding reporting from the Pacific is another milestone achievement for Papua New Guinea's oldest television station, capturing one of the country's most significant historical and a memorable send-offs to the man who led PNG to nationhood. Uh, also, um, to say that uh, it, it was a sad occasion for the country, but it was historical as well for us. Most of us did not witness the uh, the birth of a nation in 1975, which the uh, which our founding father um, uh, led, and uh, we wanted to give it our best in our coverage for both news and our live coverage. So, um, and uh, we planned and we executed. So, I want to say thank you to to uh, all the staff who were part of this broadcast, and also to the Prime Minister James Marape and his. Um, staff for allowing us to be able to uh, to give uh, our first prime minister a fitting send-off. Suli Suli, National MTV News.